If you feel lucky, we should visit the casino over. Alright. So right now we're gonna go to Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? I saw the monument at Akuz. They got a whole section about you there. It's a miracle you survived. Looks like you have a fan. I'm sorry, I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. Uh, my name's Lang, Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? I know about this Harkin. Do you know a CSEC officer named Harkin? I shouldn't really say too much. He's been on the force a lot longer than me. But I've heard things, you know? <coughs> Drinking on the job, taking bribes, that kind of thing. Rumors mostly, but they suspended him, so some of it must be true. What do you know about the Spectres? Just the stuff they show in the vids. They always make him out to be super agents on secret missions to save the galaxy. I know it's not really like that, though. Some of the other CSEC guys don't like him too much. Figure they shouldn't be able to operate outside the law. But if they were so bad, the council wouldn't use them, right? Yeah. Goodbye. I have to go. Right. You're probably real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. All right. What am I supposed to do here? Oh yeah, Chorbin. Word on the street is that you've been busy. Congratulations on taking down Fist. I was sure he was a big player in anything going on here. Did you find anything in his office that could help me? These OSDs might have the information you're looking for. <sighs> you've got Fist's files? This could be even bigger than I'd hoped. Here, Commander, for your trouble. What would my future cooperation be worth? Say, an interview when my investigation is over? Exclusive? You talk to me before you talk to anyone else? That would be worth quite a bit, and I'd be very happy to compensate you accordingly. Here you are. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should go see what's on these discs. How about a blowjob? Nope. Okay. <clears throat> Where's the ascension? Commander, I wasn't expecting to see you again. Is there something you want? The truth. You can start by telling me the truth, Shorbin. I'm not sure what you're referring to. My experiments are... We're not buying it. Jaleed told us you've been after it. You spoke with Jaleed? Then you know about the data? Not yet. No, but you're gonna tell me. Everything. You boys can go. Looks like my plans have changed. He was gonna kill us. It's not him. as bad as you think, Commander. Jaleed and I just got a little over our heads. Keep talking. The company we work for developed an experimental procedure for use in medical scanners. Jaleed and I saw even more potential, so we stole the plans and secretly developed a tool to scan the keepers. Can you imagine a tool that can actually get readings from the keepers? Okay. What's so special about that? The keepers are almost impossible to scan, and you can't capture them or get samples. They just self-destruct. 
After centuries here, we still don't know anything about them. Don't you see? We were the first to scan them, ever. You've seen it yourself, Commander. You know we can do it. That doesn't explain why you're trying to kill your partner. I'm not trying to kill him. Jalid's job was to disseminate our initial findings. But he decided to keep the data for himself. Maybe to sell it. I don't know. Mm -hmm. So you're just trying to get back what Jalid already stole. We lost our heads. We just couldn't let an opportunity like this pass us by. Commander, if you'll just continue gathering data for me, imagine what we might learn. And you'll stand to make a bit of a profit yourself, remember? I suppose a little scanning here and there won't hurt anyone? Very good. Maybe if you wouldn't mind speaking with Jalid. The data you're gathering for me is useless if Jalid won't help me analyze it. I'll go have a chat with him right now. Thank you. And happy scanning, Commander. There are a few unlicensed vendors who operate out of the markets here. Sometimes they have good stuff for sale. Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? Let me see what you have. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things I have. You will see. Holy shit. Talk to Jaleed and then go. Oh, There's a club. Oh. Let's go to the club, get a, the creeper here. That should be all, I think. you want to end up on his hit list. Yes, I heard the act. It's out of my hands, Reed. I bring her back in a second, but she doesn't want to come. Sorry, I'm kind of busy right now. So, uh, what can I do for you? Shit. Got what were you discussing with the Volus? Who, Doran? Oh, uh, I was just asking him about my sister. See, she worked for Doran before she left to... Ugh, sorry, I don't want to bore you with my problems. I'm interested to hear what you have to say. Well, okay. My sister Jenna left here to go work at Cora's Den. The problem is, she's working as an informant for CSEC. You know, eavesdropping on the people there. If they find out what she's doing, they'll kill her. <laughs> is she really at risk? I assume CSEC is protecting her? They can't watch her all the time. Mm, I don't know. Sometimes I think she stays there just to spite me. 
Do you know who her contact at CSEC is? No. It's all very secret. Last time I asked an officer, he told me to stay out of it for Jenna's safety. Alright, I'll speak with her. Maybe I could help her understand just how I'll dangerous Cora's Den is. Would you? That'd be great. Just don't tell her I sent you. Well, I should get back to work before I get in trouble. <laughs> Thanks. I'm waiting for someone else. Oh, sexy. Ah! Yeah, let's try this again. Come on, that's bullshit. Got oh, ten credits. See if I can make it a zero. Yes. Oh, come on. Yeah. That's low stakes. I gotta play high stakes. Funnel credits their way. I'll run a trace. Play high stakes. Okay. Pay me. One more time.
Oh, okay, cool. All right, again. I'm not gonna pass. Yeah. I gained 150 credits. Ah, uh, one more time. Okay, cool. Give me an eight. Or a two. I have a 50% chance. Yes! Perfect. Alright, I'll just end right there. Yeah, quick. 350 credits won. Alright, so I got that creeper. Got that creeper. Now it's time for her to have some fun. How do I dance? Can't dance here? Huh. Places like this always want to hire. Hey, good to see you now, human. I can't dance. Dun, 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 dun. Guess I can't dance yet. go to chorus then and then I'm um, leaving this place I'll be with you in just a sec. I'll wait right here. Why do I get the feeling you're not here to order drinks? I need to talk to you about your work with CSEC. Shit. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Now, if Stupid you don't mind, shepherd. I need to get back to my customers. Fine, forget it. Have it your way. He just straight up said it like in the middle of a fucking club and shit. Dumbass Shepard, I didn't think he was gonna say that. Oh. Uh, wanna start beef, huh? Wanna start beef? If you've got questions about Jenna, meet me at CSEC Academy. Huh? Are you talking to me? Push off. I never did nothing to you. Damn newcomers. Think they can run the place. What the hell was that about? I guess we'd better go find out. Let's meet him at C-Sec, right? 
Alright, we're gonna go meet this guy at C-Sec, then I'm gonna leave. I'm a Spectre, I can do whatever I want. Alright, I'm just gonna take the quick... Meet him at C-Sec. Is that the guy? Oh, he's probably in one of the, the offices. I gotta talk to two people here. To Jaheed. Hello again. Did you have any luck finding Shorbin? Yes, I did. I found out you've been lying to me, Jaleed. Lying? Why would I lie to you? You forgot to mention the data about the Keeper. Uh, he told you? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. I was afraid Shorbin would kill me to get the data, so I... Well, I was hoping you'd take care of him. <laughs> They're all the same. Yeah, doing this one. I'm scanning the keepers for Shorbin, but you two need to stop fighting. Hey, that was a you're, bad. you're helping us, but well, if you say so. You better not shoot him right there. Well, if Shorbin can forgive and forget, then so can I. I appreciate the help, Commander. I better go get that data analyzed. Hello, Commander. Detective Chellick, come into my office. I want to discuss this in private. No offense, Commander, but what the hell were you thinking? Hmm, <laughs> careful, motherfucker. Oh, I'm tempted to do that. Watch your tone, Chellick. You could have blown Jenna's cover. We were trying to help her. I gathered that. It might seem cold letting her take all the risk, but we're keeping a close eye on her. Yeah, I saw that. But you're still using her. This job isn't easy and it's usually unpleasant. I'll take help anywhere I can find it. But since you're so concerned with her safety, maybe there's a way we can help each other. It's nice to see you're still working all the angles, Chalik. As part of the job. Now, are you going to help me or not? Aww. I'll help you, but I need some details. I'm trying to track down an illegal arms producer. I just need some of their product. Thanks to Jenna's intel, I've learned there's a seller here on the Citadel. Meet our man named Jax. Pick up the mods and bring them back here. That'll give me everything I need. Why are you so concerned about these mods? We have access to some of the most sophisticated weaponry there is. It's what gives us our edge. What do you suppose happens when we lose that edge? These give criminals an advantage we can't afford to let them keep. I'll persuade Jax to tell me where these mods are coming from. No. You tip Jax off, and all my leads will disappear faster than you can say bad bust. All right. Where can I find this, Jax? Jax is down in the lower level of the markets. I'll send word through our channels that you're the buyer. Good luck, Commander. Well, wouldn't they know that a fucking Commander is... Everybody seems to know me. They know I'm a Commander of the Alliance. For the union, the union. Dun, 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 dun. 
We need to bring that back. The union. I'm surprised that you're willing to kill your own, Rex. Aren't the Krogan just a few generations away from extinction? You don't get it. For all your talk of honor and pride, the Turians never had to test their principles in a real struggle. Anyone who fights us is either stupid or on Saren's payroll. Killing the latter is business. Killing the former is a favor to the universe. Yeah. Wise words, Krogan. I would not like to meet them Krogan. Who would win in a fight? A Krogan in a fist-to-fist -fist fight? A Krogan or a Chewbacca? Are you pissed, man? Why don't you join me? You're not doing anything. I thought the first three right. And the, the next. Remember what you what you say or do is is audible. I got like, where am I supposed to go? Oh yeah, to the lower. I got three out the two. You're trolling with your schoolwork. Glass. Oh, you have sometimes you have to. Well, that's how you start off. Oh, my own Krogan. That's close enough, Army. You got my payment? Yeah. Do you have the X mods? Show them the merchandise. Looks good. Damn straight it is. These mods are the best on the market. Now hand over my credits. You're under arrest. Here you go. Here you go. Enjoy it. Come on, boys. We're done here. What are you weak ass get? Hopefully after this, finally, finally I'll be able to get out of here. Um, how is there like a, a transportation bike here? C-Sec. He's always walking there. Every time I load here, he's always walking over there. It's programmed in the code. Commander, I hear you have something for me. Here's your shipment, Chelik. Excellent. This is everything I need. Huh. Maybe more than I need. Here, Commander, take this. I won't need it, and you've earned some payment for your work. As for Jenna, I'll make sure we get her out of Kor's den immediately. Now I need to get these mods into evidence. Thanks again, Shepard. Alright. Now... I get to go. And I think that there's one more creeper over there by my ship. So I'll be able to, to do that. Let me just check the journal. Oh, I gotta do all this. Oh shit, I forgot all about this. Well, I guess I can't go to my ship. I'm gonna do these first since I'm here.
Coming up in a report later today, Emily Wong investigates corruption on the Citadel and uncovers a full-blown crime syndicate. That's it. Yeah, you gotta change Rex get. Sorry, I think that's the other side. Oh, yeah, I could have killed one the other I wonder how the houses look here. Looks cool. You know how that would it's something like there how it would look in real life. It's huge. You're with the Alliance? Welcome. It is a pleasure. Commander, I recently received a lovely note from Septimus. Thank you for speaking with him. Even the Alcor diplomat has withdrawn his campaign against me. Glad to help. Let's talk payment. It was my honor to aid you. You are too kind, Commander. But I would not expect you to help me out of the kindness of your heart. I also have one more thing to give you, if you are interested. Sure. I'd be honored. I offer a gift of words, an affirmation of who you are and who you will become. I see your skin. Tough as the scales on any Turian, unyielding. A wall between you and everyone else. But it protects you, makes you strong. That strength is what kept you alive when everyone around you was dying. You alone survived. You will continue to survive. This may be who you are, but it is not who you will become. It only forms the basis for your future greatness. Remember these words when doubt descends, Commander. Thank you. Again. You have quite a gift, Shaira. Thank you. Not everyone appreciates it as you do. Never underestimate the power of words. Here, Commander. In light of your efforts with the Elcor Ambassador, I would like you to have this small trinket. What is it? A small mystery. I have never learned its use or purpose, but I sense it is time for me to pass it on. And now I must ask you to leave. I have done everything I can for you. That's it. Remember my words, Commander Shepard. They will give you strength. So long, Commander. I can offer you nothing more at this time. Well, fuck you. Should have put his daddy.
Let's see what else I have to do. Guess who's back? Oh man. So what have you been doing up to? Alright, what's this in here? Nah, he keeps cursing now. I know. Don't oh. point out the obvious. Ooh! Is that the N7 armor right there? Okay, yeah, guys. Hanar refuses to listen to reason. Why can't it act in an orderly and lawful manner? What's the problem? Are there laws <clears throat> being broken here? I am not unreasonable. The Hanar is free to spew its nonsense once it purchases an evangelical permit. So if the Hanar gets a permit, it's allowed to preach? No. Registered evangelicals must follow regulations. There are specific areas where preaching is legal. Failure to follow the regulations results in the forfeiture of the license. What's the purpose behind the evangelical permits? Forcing religious evangelicals to register for a permit weeds out undesirables. It keeps the area safe. The Citadel is too important to become a battleground for a religious war. Why don't you just arrest the Hanar? I could arrest the Jelly, but my superior has requested that I find a solution that does not anger the Hanar. The Hanar become vocal when they feel their religious beliefs are being suppressed. Let me talk if you'd to like, you. I could talk to the Hanar for you. I have argued with the stubborn jelly all afternoon. You are certainly welcome to try. Do you desire to learn of the Enkindlers? Or has the Honorable CSEC officer enlisted assistance? Uh, this is in the way. Is this really how you want to represent the Enkindlers? The truth of the Enkindlers must be made known. They gave the Hanar language and gave the universe the mass relays. Well, the Enkindlers are this the one only wishes to spread the truth to any who will listen. There is no intent to cause trouble. This is. Um... Yeah. Is this how the Enkindlers would want you to use this gift of consciousness? The Enkindlers would wish for their message to be spread to all sentient races. Not this way. The Enkindlers wouldn't wish their message to be spread by breaking society's laws. This one hears wisdom. Perhaps enthusiasm has clouded judgment in this matter. This one departs now and will not intrude upon the Presidium again. Mm. Give me money. I see the Hanar is left. Thank you. Not a problem. Happy to help. No problem for your assistance in this matter. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should report to my superiors. Where are we about to go? Find our scan this one. You only get 70, 70 credits? That's little. What can you do with 70 credits? Gamble. Gamble, buy drugs. What are you supposed to do? Um, there's something here. Every time we leave. No, oh, they're not from there.
A Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site, claiming that artifacts of the Enkindlers, as the Hanar call them, should not be disturbed. The excavation team has appealed to Hanar representatives on the Citadel to reach a diplomatic solution. All right, uh, I'm going to take a break in this uh, elevator down, and we're going to exit in uh, the wards. I'm trying to find something. All right, bye.